Hi everybody, Cheryl here. I have been sitting here since I did uploaded my last video because um, I said I wanted to make my own Christmas cards <laughs> and since I did that video I've been playing around. <laughs> so this is what I came up with. I thought I'd have to share. Um, first of all, it's not as easy as you think it is. Um, my mother sent me a card today and I used her envelope as a pattern and I tried to draw it out on one of these papers and it just didn't, it didn't, it didn't work like that. Um, I had to waste a few sheets to figure out how to do it. I'd basically take the card and yeah, my table is covered right now so I can't find it but basically what I did was I took the card and I traced her card in and then I kind of then played around with making um a pattern to make an envelope because you want to make the envelope a little bit bigger than the card so now I have a pattern on this one because <laughs> I'm going to use the butterfly for this but basically what I did was I took and, and I want to point out the cardstock that I got for five bucks at Michael's this is thick heavy duty cardstock that is it's really good stuff so um what I'm going to do though is I'm going to probably go on my my printer and print out some you know the labels um to you know like with our addresses and I have and I'm sure all you guys have these the my little stuff here but like the scissors that cut um the really pretty designs and stuff and just cut the names out because this is the envelope that I made and I put some of the tape around here and I'm gonna put you know the the to and from address labels on here and I'm gonna make them kind of pretty with cutting it out but this is the envelope that I made. This one's for my good friend. So um, I wanted it to be a little more flashy because it's for my good friend. I mean, the one I'm making for my mom's going to be a little bit more low-key and Christmassy. But this is basically what I came up with with the Christmas card. Um, now, on the cardstock that I got, the, the book of paper... You know, you can cut out, and I'm trying to grab them here. You can cut out all those sayings and these little squares and stuff, and you could probably, you know, cut around those too with those scissors and make them pretty. But like all of these, you can you cut these out and drop them on your floor, and you can decorate your floor with them. No, <laughs> no, you cut all these out, and these are great for the cards. And I'm still decorating my floor with them. So, you know, that's, that's really great. And then, like, some of the ones I got from Michaels have, like, friend sayings on them. And be creative sayings. And just really cute springy sayings. So what I did was, this is kind of just a simple card, was I took this paper, this cardstock. And you can see what I did. Um, I put one of those squares on here. And then I... Put tape around it put a couple stickers i put like a little dove sticker and then one of the i don't know if you can see that or not like the old-fashioned um um yeah <laughs> tree decoration my brain i've been sitting here cutting out craft paper all night so i'm i'm done so <laughs> this is the front of it and it's just kind of simple and like i said i just you know went around it with the the striping tape that I bought and same with this this card it actually worked really nice that I had a polka dot one that worked good with this so um and then when you open it I used the striped tape as you can see and then I put my sticker what one that says joyous noel and then um a couple of these stickers and then you know now there's room to where I could put um you know personalize it and and just write what I want in here and and whatever so I just wanted to share that with you I'm it's it's not that much work it's once you get going and once you start cutting these things out and you have them and once you figure out your envelope situation it's really not that bad 
Um, I wish though, however, oh my goodness. I wish though I would have picked up more of these stickers here because these are just so stinking cute. And I love how it's a clear background. So when you go to stick these on, I don't know if you can see that, on the cards, it looks, you know, it looks nice. It doesn't have a white, a white backing on it. So, um, I wish I'd have got more of those. I don't know. Maybe my local Walmart might have something like this. I have no idea. I doubt it. But um, I guarantee you tomorrow I'm going to be looking around my town and seeing if they have a craft store. <laughs> because I want to see if I can get some more Christmas stickers. Because, you know, I got the more fun ones and things like that too. But, you know, for, for the adults in the family, you know, you want it to be not so busy um with the kids stuff but i also showed in my one of my other hauls where um hobby lobby had these um where you can make these little decorations and they have all sorts of them i noticed that when i went this time they were almost out of everything but everything's still 50 percent off and there was uh 24 gingerbread houses in here that i could make and what I did was, um, I put them together, and then what I did was I bought these extra little puffy stickers here and put these little guys in the, um, in the doorway, and I put a snowflake up here. And then what I did was I took a paper hole punch, and I punched a hole, and then I put this uh, ribbon on here, so... Whoever gets these, um, you can hang it on your doorknob. You can hang it wherever. I just thought these were adorable. So um, I thought, and they and it fits nicely in in the card too, because this is a very thick. Uh, you can hear that very thick card, and everything will fit in here nicely. So anyway. That was my share. I Like I said, as you can see, I had to put my scarf on. I was freezing. I'm sitting here cold. Um, we haven't put plastic up on the windows yet. And I'm just freezing my butt off, so I had to put my scarf on. <laughs> um, so anyway, I just wanted to share that with you. Um, I'm curious um, are you, if you guys are going to make your own Christmas cards this year. If you do, I want to see them. Um, I'm really excited. I got so much stuff to play with. I'm going to try to personalize some, some more cards for my family and my friends. And I don't know, maybe I'll try to get maybe two made a day, maybe three a day for the next few days. Maybe everybody will get one by Christmas. We'll see. <laughs> I don't know. So anyway, thank you all for watching. I just wanted to share this with you. So let me know if you guys are going to do it. Um, I think it'd be cool to see what you guys come up with. So anyway, love you guys. I'm going to go to bed. So talk to you later. Bye.